What's up YouTube, I'm Jack, and this is Jack Reacts, and today, y'all, we have another very highly requested video. Today, we got Boys to Men, Motown Philly. I'm excited to get into this because it is Boys to Men. I've done maybe two, three songs from them, and all of them have been incredible. All of them can sing, not with an I, with an A. Now, I chose this song in particular, though, because a good bit of my patrons asked me to do it. Which, speaking of, if you are a patron, you will get early access to this video. Thank you so much for the support. Anyways, I'm not going to talk too long on this one, y'all. I got the lyrics pulled up. As always, y'all know the drill. Let me know what I miss in the comments below, and let's go ahead and get right into it. Whoa. This got like a new jazz swing sound to it. This is Boys to Men? Okay. Hey, this is very different from the other songs I've done for them. I'm liking it though. Wine, you're right there, right? Man, they look young. Dude, there's that harmonization right there. Hey, this chorus is too catchy. I love this hook. Hold on, I gotta go to pause it right there. I'll run it back like five, 10 seconds. Y'all don't worry, but I need to touch on a few things. A few things that are really sticking out to me. So number one, this has got to be earlier than the other songs I've done from Boys to Men. This looks and sounds like it was probably the early 90s. I think the other songs I've done from them were mid to late 90s. They had like a real slow feel to it. This has like an upbeat New Jack swing sound to it. Almost reminds me a little bit of maybe Bobby Brown. But the big thing that's different from Bobby Brown is that this is a group and I love that because I get that harmonization they sound so good when all of them come together I definitely think they have one of my favorite group harmonizations of any group I ever reacted to definitely of any male group I reacted to for sure I really like the guy with the deep voice who was doing the ad-libs every now and then I don't know if you would call that a baritone I think that's what it is I really like him he sounds really good you know I just like a deeper voice in general that be said Wanya was doing his thing I gotta put some respect on Wanya's name I just did a song with him and Brandy the other day. Now it was incredible. Shout out to Wanya. Gotta clap it up for him. And I gotta clap it up for all of them. All of them are killing it. Not just with the singing though. They were killing it on the dance moves. I didn't know they could dance. They were doing the little high step two-step i don't know all the the turns but they were killing it and they were rocking the flat tops too that's how i know this was earlier anyways i'm gonna run it back a few seconds and let's get back to it I'm about to rap it's very different yeah see there's that doo-wop sound I talk about that all the time. Ooh. Mm. So that's like their little origin, okay. So they were like high school friends, that's dope. This video is too fun. This is one of the most fun videos I've done, for real. The hell are them? Yeah, they are really rapping well. 
<laughs> yeah, it's Wanya. Ooh. Fire. That's that doo right there. I just said that. Remind me of, like New Jack City. Nino Brown. Dudes huddle around the, the trash can. With like a Bronx tail. But at the same time, it's got the New Jack swing element to it. Yeah, this was dope. Fire. That's the best words I can describe it. I love the different combinations of genres on this one. I just mentioned doo-wop. I mentioned New Jack Swing. There was definitely a hip-hop element to it for sure. I don't know what that sample is in the background. The, the, the yelling sample. Y'all know what I'm talking about. But I heard that in another song before. Like a famous old-school hip-hop song. I can't remember which one it was. But I definitely recognized that, that sound that was sampled in the song. Beat was fire though. Again, just typical New Jack Swing sound. But this was really interesting interesting i had a really fun time with this and it was fun to basically see the origin of boys to men definitely very very different from the other songs i've done from them and you know i don't know if they were kind of pressured by their label to do this or this was their original sound this is what they do and then they ended up getting pressured by their label to become what they became regardless i like both sides of them i like the smoother laid back r&b side and i like this side of them you know the little hip-hop r&b new jack swing sound to them but in both elements, in both eras, the earlier and later stuff, they still kept that doo-wop sound. I feel like that's what sets them apart from other groups. They have this kind of old school 50s, 60s vibe to them that's very unique from any other group I've ever reacted to. Shout out to Boys to Men for this one. This is hard. This is going on the playlist. I shouldn't have to say it. This might go on like the gym playlist or something. I was really getting a lot of energy to it. You know, I feel like I can lift weights, run on the treadmill to this for sure. That being said, y'all, that is it for the video video that's all i gotta say about this one thank you so much to all of you who recommended this to me especially my patrons again thank you so much for the support and if y'all like this one please make sure to like subscribe turn on notifications if you haven't already and comment in your requests down below i will get to them as soon as possible and if y'all like to further support me i can check out my patreon link in bio your support means the world i cannot express it enough wish y'all have a blessed day blessed night whatever part of the world you're watching this in and peace